today we are going to solve the problem a of educational code forces round 150 the problem name is game with board now let's read the problem alice and bob play a game they have a blackboard initially there are 10 integers written on it and each integer is equal to 1 let's consider n is equal to 4 and then 4 1 will be written on the board. Alice and Bob take turns. Alice goes first. On their turn, the player has to choose several, at least two equal integers on the board, wipe them, and write a new integer which is equal to their sum. So basically, this card is. अपने को जैसे चार इंटीजर ये दिए हैं पहली टर्न होगी एलिस की एलिस क्या कर सकता है दो या दो से ज्यादा इंटीजर सिलेक्ट करने हैं और उनके उनको मिटा देना और उनका जो सम है वो उस, उनकी जगह रिप्लेस कर देना है जैसे इस केस में अपन वी कैन सिलेक्ट टू वन वी कैन वाइप देम and can write their sum in place of them. One one new sequence will be. And now it's Bob turn, so he have to select these two integers. There is no other option. So now the sequence will be two two. And now it's Alice turn, and he have to select these two integers. Now sequence will be four. तो इस हिसाब से कौन जीता बॉब जीत गया पर दोनों ऑप्टिमली खेल रहे हैं दोनों जीतने की कोशिश करेंगे तो टेस्ट केसेस देखते हैं और आगे बढ़ते हैं e till 99 and till 100 नो प्रॉब्लम लेट्स कंसीडर ऑल द टेस्ट केसेस n शुड बी ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू 2 सो n विल व्हेन n विल बी 2 Sequence will be one one. Alice have to select these two integers. Now the sequence will be two, two one, Bob one. If n is equal to three. अगर n three है, तो एक एक एक. So Alice can select all these three integers. Sequence will be three. Or Alice can select any of two integers. Then sequence will be two one. In both cases, Bob cannot do anything. So, Bob will win. N equal to 4. 1, 1, 1, 1. If Alice select all 4 integers, then sequence will be 4. Now, Bob, Bob won. If Alice select 3 integers, now the sequence will be 3. Now, Bob will win. And if sequence, if Alice select 2 integers, then sequence will be 2, 1, 1. Now Bob have to select these two integers, then sequence will be 2, 2. And now Alice has to select these two integers. So the sequence will be 4. Then also Bob. Now if the case is n is equal to 5. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. We can clearly see. If Alice select these four integers, who will want? Who will want? Bob. But if Alice select these three integers, then three one one, and Bob can Bob have to choose has to choose these two integers. Then the sequence will be three two. Who won? Alice. And if the sequence is one 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 one, Alice can select these four integers. Left these two integers for two, added by Bob. And Add all the integers. All the integer value will be greater than 2. E, 4, 5, 6, anything possible. The number of integers n minus 2. So the sum will be n minus 2. Means 4 and 1, 1. Bob have to select these two integers. 4, 2, 2, 1. L is 1. So it's pretty simple. If we can clearly see if n is greater than or equal to 5, then L is 1 won the game. If otherwise, 12, 1, Bob. 
now just add the code ll n input le liya n ka ab kya karenge if n is greater than equal to 5 kon jiye ga otherwise kon jiye ga let submit it accepted so that's pretty constructive problem basic maths thank you